What up, Magic Gang? Welcome to a very special video today. That's a good fry. What up, y'all? So, as you can see, got this yesterday. Mmm. Beautiful birds in the area, by the way. And we got some delicious food in front of us today. We got a ginormous sandwich over here. All of this food has meaning. Let me just have some more fries. This sauce I'm dipping the fries into is peanut sauce. And I put some peanut sauce on the fries. Mmm. I love peanut sauce. Mmm. Mmm. We got fried rice over here, and it has shrimp and sausages in it. Yesterday, I got my first tattoo. Um, this is something I always wanted to get. However, it's a big decision. It's something that some people never get in their lifetime. Let me get a bite of some of this fried egg that you saw in there. I love me some fried rice so much. And the place I picked it up from, Pho Saigon Pearl, is one of my favorite Vietnamese restaurants. And there is a reason why I picked Vietnamese food for this special occasion. First of all, it's delicious. If you never had Vietnamese food, you need to. Mmm. Mmm. That stuff is so good. And with the egg yolk mixed into the fried rice, can't go wrong with that. Vietnamese food. This is one of my favorite foods in the world, and one of my icons, Anthony Bourdain, uh, loved Vietnamese food, and he especially loved banh mi sandwiches. Now, it's very interesting, the banh mi, the origination. Yo, this place makes good fries, too. Put peanut sauce on your fries, guys. So, in the 1860s, there were French colonists in Vietnam, and with the French, they brought their baguettes. So, you have this sandwich called a banh mi, and it uses a baguette, as you see here. Huge sandwich, and in Vietnamese, banh mi means bread. Beautiful French baguette encasing some grilled and marinated pork with some jalapenos and a little pickle of veggies. Let's take a bite. Mmm. Wait. They have vinegar, which you can add. Dip the bread in that. So here's with vinegar. Mm. And it makes for one of the most delicious sandwiches. I was going to move the camera, but Plus, Saigon Pearl makes one of the best in LA. Look at that. Mmm. They also have shrimp. They also have shrimp chips. Mmm. 
But yeah, man, Vietnamese food is absolutely delicious. So this is such a good meal. And you may be wondering, Mikey, do tigers even live in Vietnam? And the answer is yes. However, mm, I love their fries. Uh, the Indo-Chinese tiger, which is native to that area. Mm. So, simply put, yes. I got a pork and a veggie egg roll. I love me a good egg roll. So, dip it in the peanut sauce to start off. Mmm. Look at that. Mmm. This food is amazing. But, <clears throat> but yesterday was a pretty incredible experience and my friend did the tattoo, um, but came out beautiful as you can see. And I think I'm gonna get an, another one in the future. I, at 100K, I'll probably get my next one. Mm. This fried rice with the sausages inside of it. And we got egg yolk in there. Who loves them some fried rice? Mm. This is good eating. Vietnam, beautiful country, beautiful culture. Mmm. They cooked that bread perfectly today. Pho Saigon makes the best, the thickest egg rolls. Amazing, and I think this is the veggie one. The pork one was really good. That moment when you eat all the peanut sauce. Story of my life. Shrimp chips. Love these. Mmm. Little hint of shrimp to them, but just a salty, tasty chip. But yeah, all my life, I knew I was gonna get a tattoo at some point in my life, but it had to have special symbolism behind it, special meaning. And I explained to you guys in one video the. Mmm. More fried rice. Mm. Next time you get fried rice, get egg with it. Egg yolk with fried rice takes it to another level. Their fry game is unreal. Mmm. Who loves ketchup with their fries? I'm in a ketchup and peanut sauce mood today. I don't know if you've ever experienced that, but today's the day for me. Mmm. I love it.
So to sum up, the meaning behind this and what I'm eventually probably going to put on it is a tiger coming out of the jungle, symbolizing the hero epic. The hero usually leaves for a while from the village or from the town that he lives in, and then he eventually comes back after he's spent time alone, time realizing what his mission is in life, So, when I read that in undergrad, uh, it always, it had special meaning to me. It always, you know, in times where I, f where I felt I was alone, I thought of that and I thought of all the heroes, even like Hercules. So it just helped me out during times when I found myself alone, or at least I felt like that. That at the end of the day, I had a mission, I had a goal. And if you're somebody right now who is feeling lost in life just or alone, just know that this is part of your story that's making you stronger and eventually will lead to something. If you are focused and you are determined and you have the eye of the tiger. Mm -hmm. Keep on keeping on. Now, That is a great combo. Look at the shrimp. Their grilled shrimp is amazing. Mmm. But I did it for my own personal reasons. So I want I want to clarify that a bit. And, uh, but yeah, it was really cool. Didn't hurt. Um, easy, chill, relaxed time. And my buddy is a pro. So I had an incredible experience to say the least. And let me tell you, YouTube has been an incredible experience to say the least. I love you all, Magic Gang for life. So I've just been grubbing from the intro today. Mm. We got the egg. Vietnamese food guys Go get yourself some Now Thank you so much for being a part of my journey and the support it means the world to me I hope I was able to explain it properly. I will see you in the next video Don't forget to hit that subscribe button because I don't want you missing any videos if you enjoy the content And if you enjoy the content make sure to throw this a thumbs up Guys, you're the best. Thank you for watching. I will see you in the next episode of Magic Gang for Life. Cheers. That moment when you eat all the peanut sauce.